Nature in Scotland is in a bad way. One of our biggest problems is that people think what they see in Scotland is normal and natural when it is anything but. The last few years, you know, we really noticed a big decline in that. They're, they're, they're hugely down and there's no denying that. They've, they've reduced at least by 70%. Salmon are in crisis. I think it would be lazy to say that all the problems for Atlantic salmon are at sea. It's becoming more apparent that survival of salmon at sea is also linked to the conditions in freshwater. The surrounding land use has a huge effect on, on what happens in the river. We don't look at the upland river catchments and think they should be trees, but they actually should be trees. What we've done essentially is turn the hills from a thatched roof into a slate roof. If we don't get trees in them in the next few decades, we're going to lose salmon from over 300 kilometres of river potentially. What salmon do is they take marine nutrients and bring them back into the river systems. That nutrient that they've taken from the sea gets taken up by all the animals, the vegetation and, and even the trees. No one animal exists in isolation. It's a deeply interconnected web. I don't think anyone wants to be known for abusing the land anymore. And we've all been guilty of it. Scotland without salmon is definitely a possibility and it would be a tragedy.